Hello everyone and peace of Christ to all of you. In the day of the debate between uh, Hijab and David Wood, a Muslim guy, he asked Hijab, are you willing to debate Christian Prince? And he said, yes. But Hijab, he calculated his numbers and he said to himself, uh oh, somebody, uh, Christian Prince will hear this now. And then I have to make what I promised to come true. Let us hear this video first and see what hijab he just said yesterday and love together. Mohammed Hijab, hello. Hey, I want to ask you a question. I didn't have the opportunity and I, and I drive about four hours far away. So listen. Hey. Hey. Relax. Go, go, come on, man. Listen. I want to ask you a question. Will Will you debate? <laughs> <laughs> All right, pay attention. The question I'm not going to ask uh, the gentleman is very smart guy, well prepared. But David Wood, you know, because he don't speak Arabic, you know, he was not a match for you. Be honest with you. Yeah, he okay? wasn't. No, yeah. no. <laughs> Listen to me. Okay, wait, 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 wait. But it was from Allah. Will from you? Allah. The question is, yes. will you willing to yes. debate on YouTube, uh, yes. Christian Prince? Yes. Yes. Say yes. yes. Say yes. Say yes. He comes to me. He comes on to YouTube. Me. I will brother, finish brother, you him. Send down. To me. Okay, great. Yes. He comes to me and I will finish him. And the guy, he said to him, Christian Prince in YouTube. So he knew what I'm talking about. He knew that I debated in, in YouTube. And now look at those two potatoes. What they are saying, taking back the promise because they are terrified of the career ending of debating me. Listen to this and see how coward they are. Like, like, let's move, let's move on, Sean. Like, let, let's talk about challenges, okay? Yeah, yeah. What challenges now are you facing? Not right now. <laughs> ah. I mean, what are you? <laughs> ah, wait, let's talk about individually. Let's yeah, talk about yeah. as an organization. What what's what's next, basically? Are you talking about challenges and, uh, on a debate level? Like, oh, that that, okay. Let's let's discuss that first because that has been mentioned. I mean, yeah. people are calling you out left, right, and center. Now, yes, yes, no, no, yes. No, no, they can't. Who did it? No, no, no. There's, we have strict conditions now. Yeah. You can't have any Tom, Dick, and Harry. Some guys, you're looking at them and like, like, like no disrespect. Like you, one guy came and mentioned some. The Egyptian boy. <laughs> the Egyptian guy. Okay, yeah, Egyptian yeah. Boy, yeah? Play. <laughs> they are calling me Egyptian boy, my friend. You are the boy, and your prophet is the boy, and you are just trying to make a mockery so you can run away. You made a promise, you coward. And let us see who is the boy. It is both of you coward liars. I got you busted, and you are afraid to get busted. You say to the guy you want to debate me, first of all, I am not an Egyptian. Secondly, let us debate and see who is the boy. Two guys, like this guy, Ali Dawa, I don't even think he have a high school. And yet he's talking about boy. You don't even know how to say and to quote a verse in your Quran. Both of you are a bunch of stupid who do not know anything about Islam and you are calling me a boy? I have to call you a stupid because obviously you are a boy. How you swallow your promise that you will debate me and now you will run away? And you know, are you going, as long as you are going to crush me anyway? I mean, what is the point? Why you don't crush me? And I mean, the guy, he make a chance. It is you who claim, Muslims, that you can debate the Christians. And look, somebody came to us and he challenged us. And right away, you see, this is the question they give to this guy to ask them. They are trying to escape the challenge and the promise they made. So, when I say to you, they will never debate me, I know they will never do so, because that would be a career ending for the money scamming. Few hours after the debate with David Wood, they asked people to donate to them 50,000 pounds, immediately. And they knew, I am not David Wood. Even though the debate with David Wood was priceless. Watch my videos, the one I made for those guys, and see how I get them busted. Even I wasn't there. So what would happen if I was there? Listen carefully what this Abdul will say. Egyptian boy, I'm not an Egyptian. You both are Egyptian. I am not. Egyptian <laughs> boy. There's something calls himself princess or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. He called himself a princess. So you see, who see who is the boy? They are talking about speaking with respect and standard, and they are they are the one who called David Wood boy in the debate. I mean, the guy, he came to you, he speak to you with respect. You say a boy, we smash your boy. 
You are the one who made make mockery of people and you have no respect. And now you are calling me a boy because you are trying to avoid debating me? Princess? My name is a princess? Why? I am like your prophet who put eyeliner in his eyes three times a day? I am like your prophet who put the skirt of his wife and he sleep with it and he says that he never received Quran unless in the wife clothes? I am like your prophet who puts a man down his belly? I am your prophet who promised you in the heaven that there is a market where there is images of women and men and if you like an image you go inside it and have sex with it? Even if it is an image of a man? The princess, my friend, is your prophet. Continue. Yeah, okay. like, like, come on, man. Seriously, Who are you? Man, trying to make any, we have a strict standard, yeah? Uh -huh. After Allah Spontalis performance through uh, Muhammad and his no. thing, come on, brother, we've got some high standards here now, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> my friend, your debate with David would prove that you are a bunch, both of you are a bunch of idiots. You admit it, but everything David would, he said, both of you without knowing how stupid you are and the lies you made is going to expose Islam brother we have a standard brother we have a standard coward coward I want every Muslim to say to this guy let us say for the sake of argument Christian Prince is not in your standard I mean what you will lose if you add a victory to your victory they claim they have a victory against David Wood the fact it was a horrible debate for Islam Watch the video I made for them and see how stupid, what, how much they are lying about their God and their prophet. Brother, we have a standard, brother. There, there's a guy, princess, brother, princess, brother. On a debate level. Like, oh, that that, okay, let's, let's discuss that first because that has been mentioned. I mean, yeah. people are calling you out left, right and center. Now. Yes, yes, no, no, yes. No, 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 they can't. Who did it? No, no, no. There's, we have strict conditions now, yeah? Now, now, now we have a strength condition. Like yesterday is not the same as today. <laughs> Listen, Harry. Some guys, you're looking at them and like, like, like no disrespect. Like you, one guy came and mentioned some. The Egyptian boy. <laughs> the, Egyptian, the Egyptian guy. Okay, yeah, the yeah. Egyptian boy, yeah. Blame. The Egyptian, Blame. Boy. Uh, he, there's something calls himself princess or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, okay. like, like, who are you, man? Seriously, man, you're trying to make a name. We have a strict... Who are you, my friend? Let me tell you who I am. I'm a person who have a degree in Islamic law. Who are you? I'm a person who have nine books written by me about Islam. Who are you? Both of you. Can one Islamic organization hire you to teach even elementary school in Islam? Who are you? Cowards. You get you busted? And now they are trying to make the excuse right away after they promised the guy in their video that they will debate me they said to themselves oh, oh and look the first thing they start talking about is not to debate a christian prince why by the by putting him down oh we have a different standard brother we are people of standard yeah we are people who marry six years old girl but we have a standard we are people who follow a prophet who slept with his auntie in the grave, but we have a standard. We are people who teach and promote that we can have sex with the children, but we have a standard. We are people who believe that we can lie to our wife and we have a standard. We are people who believe that the God will make us endless penis, but we have a standard. We are people who believe that God will provide us with 80,000 virgin, and many of them, they are imported from the hooker house in the house of Allah, but we have a standard, brother. What is your standard? You are a scammer, not a stander. Be the man, both of you. You are doing business. 50,000 pounds, you ask for it, in less than six hours after the debate. And now they are trying to promote you. I challenge you. I challenge the guy who is taking the boogers from his nose with you. I challenge everyone who claim about standards to debate me, but you will never do so. You know your standard. This is why. Because you know your standard, you will never dare to get close to me. That is the truth. Share this video, guys. Feel free to download it, share it around, and show everybody how they run away from me. All of them. Cowards. I am a Christian prince, and this is my standard. We don't follow Muhammad, for he is a Buddha file. We don't follow Muhammad, for he is a criminal. We don't follow Muhammad because he's a rapist. We don't follow Muhammad even because even the Muslims accuse him that he stole under underwear. And yet you talk about a standard. 
what a stand do you have thank you very much for watching and may the lord bless you all and i will see you soon again this is a christian prince god bless you all thank you very much